you can get your movie tickets online and then go over on a geek website and spoil the whole movie. Well, the ending, anyway. But this doesn't change the fact that all movies are falling flat because of being oversaturated with posters and trailers and spoilers and comic adaptations before you even get to the theater on opening night. By then, you're all in a, you pretty much already know everything and you're going to get very disappointed. Because back in the day, there was no internet. There was no spoilers or leaked set pictures. They only had the trailer. And those trailers you could only see in front of the latest movie release. There wasn't... There probably... Well, yeah. There wasn't anything you could replay over and over again on QuickTime or some crap. I mean, look at the trailers for Jaws and E.T. Look them up here on YouTube. Do you see the creature? Do you see... Do you know how it's going to work out in the end? No, you don't. But the trailers are, so, are short, sweet, and they leave you wanting more. In, in saying this, I asked a simple question. What is the formula? And you know... When I was when I kept saying this, I was going to argue because this that it's because the studios are slave to the brand, or maybe studios don't give a shit anymore. But then I realized something. Yeah, we got a crap load of movies that are nothing but a remake or a reboot or a big summer extravaganza that's based on a comic book or a cartoon, a TV show or a book. Let's face it, that ain't going to change anytime soon. You know why? Jaws. And Superman, two of probably two of the greatest movies of all time, if you ask me, were based on a book and a comic book, respectively. Because let's face it, there will never be a moment where we where we only have adaptations or reboots. Sure, the original screenplays. Sure, there will be screenplays out there like a Star Wars or. Goonies, Gremlins, E.T., Ghostbusters. But let's face it, they're becoming less and less for the fe for fear the audience won't recognize, leaving more room for well-known brands. But sometimes, some gems slip by. Case in point, The Matrix, The Hangover, Inception, and Avatar. Not exactly in order, but you get what I You know what I mean. The answer to that, my friends, is that there is no formula. There is only a problem.